What's up everyone? Brian, Logan, Priscilla. and Priscilla here. And today we are at... Epcot. Epcot, as you can see by the giant ball behind me. Logan, where's the ball? Where's the ball? <laughs> he already knows. So this is Logan's first time at Epcot. So we are going to basically just explore the park today, give him a little introduction, go on some Logan friendly rides today. <laughs> um, I will say this is Memorial Day week. So Guardians of the Galaxy is the newest ride that just opened recently here at Epcot. So they do have a virtual queue as the option for waiting in line that you can do through the app. However, we tried this we morning. We tried, didn't work. Epic fail, so. So you can try at 7 a.m. You can be in your house. Uh, as long tried. as you have reservations for the yeah. day for Epcot. So we did try and it was seven on the dot. Yeah, I had my phone out counting the seconds. She had her phone and as soon as it turned seven, she was hitting the refresh button on the app. Some of you may already be familiar with this, but that's basically the process. Yeah. But didn't work. We'll try again soon. Um, the second option you have is the one o'clock period, which you were yeah. just saying. But you have to be in the park. Yeah, you have to be in the park. And because I was working today, there's no way we were able to do that. So however, uh, we're just gonna make the most of our Epcot reservation day and uh, have some fun, right? Yes. Yeah. Right, Logan? Yeah. <laughs> Let me tell you guys, the videos I've seen before of this, the giant spaceship in the pavilion here, it looks super small, but in person, this thing is way more massive. I guess it would be to actual scale how they built it. So it looks pretty cool. But anyways, so yeah, Guardians of the Galaxy, Xandarian pavilion behind us. Uh, I guess in our scenario, so close but yet so, so far, far because we are not doing it today sadly enough <laughs> and we would have to do child swap anyways because we have logan with us but no big deal logan you see the spaceship back there where's the spaceship yeah <laughs> he got it he was like he just saw the uh millennium falcon last week for the first time and now he's seeing the uh, guardians of the galaxy uh What's the name of the spaceship? I don't know. Xandarian ship, I guess, because we're apparently uh, by Xandar, or on the planet of Xandar, or I think this is a portal to Xandar. So anyways, I think the first thing we're gonna go ahead and do, we're gonna take Logan over to Nemo, right? Because of course, since he's never been here before, he's never been on Nemo, and I really like Nemo. <laughs> We're at the uh, Coca-Cola place. Haven't been here at the new one ever. Yeah. The old one was like way more elaborate. Um, but who can pass up from free, well, I guess included in the price yeah. of the park, <laughs> soft drinks from around the world. This is the Madagascar one. <laughs> bon Bon Inglis. Probably sound very white. <laughs> and Logan <laughs> is just having fun chewing on the cup. He's not getting soda right now. He has his water. <laughs> what did you try? I tried the Minute Maid from uh, Korea. It was really good. Yeah? Mm -hmm. Well, here is uh, to Bon Bon Inglis. Yes. Like a shot. <laughs> that's, that's not bad. <laughs> Logan, you know the best way to experience the Coca-Cola experience? 
is you got to do a suicide where you get a little bit of every single one and then at the very end you top it off with Beverly and then chug it. <laughs> That's how you do it. Mm. Ah, so much sugar. I'm gonna be all jacked up <laughs> for the rest of this vlog. Warning guys, watch out. And this is why, in my opinion, Epcot is one of the best theme parks is because there are so many little things within Epcot that are not rides that don't require you to wait in an actual line to experience. And so you get a lot more out of it than like a standard theme park where you have to go in line to do something. So just like this. I mean, this is cool that they offer this. They don't have to do that. Obviously, Coca-Cola is a big sponsor of why this is here. So it's kind of promoting that. And I feel water spilling on my feet. Yeah. <laughs> so anyways, yeah, pretty cool. I just poured his water. <laughs> we tricked him. We just poured his water in the Coca-Cola cup. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Fresh men, fresh men, fresh men. <laughs> Priscilla just had a really good point. So obviously, oh man, I'm talking fast now from all the sugar. <laughs> so because like the Coca-Cola experience is obviously free, pro tip number two, remember in the last video we had pro tip number one, this is number two. At Epcot, why would you ever pay for our soda, right? When you can just hop on over to the Coca-Cola experience and drink soda there. So obviously we're not huge soda people, but you know, when we're experiencing a theme park, we'll indulge a little bit. How cool this new yeah, and this is um, so big. Creation Shop, one of the new uh, stores. It's really pretty in there, a lot of space. Because that's one of the problems with gift shops at theme parks is it always feels so crammed in there sometimes, especially on super busy days. But yeah, we'll have to, uh, before we leave, we need to definitely check that out. So another reason why Epcot is one of my personal favorite parks is because of how they transform the park throughout the year. So, without me really saying much, it's obviously the Flower and Garden Festival right now. Just look how awesome this is going all the way around. The amount of work that they put into that is yeah. probably insane. Especially with this heat, like how they kept all of them, like, you know, all the flowers. Yeah, like, yeah. So it's definitely a major project. And one of the cool things with the Flower and Garden Festival is as you walk throughout the park, they have um, all the characters all made out of plant some flowers <laughs> what's the official term to topiary oh, topiary yeah, yeah. something like that <laughs> yeah, yeah. but yeah so it gives you throughout the year a full a really different experience mm -hmm. as you come and enjoy this park yeah you have the festival of food and wine too oh food and wine festival that's dangerous <laughs> but very expensive so i guess that's very dangerous <laughs> it's very good though <laughs> so there we go like i just said example a we got Mufasa, Simba, Rafiki, and what's the mom's name? I always forget. Logan, what sound does a lion make? What's say? What sound does a lion make? He, he, he's camera shy. You may have heard it a little bit. Roar! There we go. <laughs> The seas with Nemo and friends, and it's the kind of wait time I like. Oh, yeah. Five minutes. Whoa, I thought it was Too bad, baby. Shark doo 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 doo. Oh, baby. He's getting excited. Woo -hoo -hoo. He's used to go to aquarium, so I think he could find it. Did you enjoy Nemo? Yes. 
Yeah, Nemo's super cool. So now we are in the aquarium that Nemo empties out into. So now we're gonna see some awesome fish, right? <laughs> and maybe some rays and some sharks. Maybe we'll even see baby shark. Baby shark. <laughs> All right, guys, so we made it to the butterfly exhibit, Bambi's butterfly exhibit, which is one of the unique things that they have during the Flower and Garden Festival. Look how cool all these butterfly cocoons are right here. Logan, this is pretty awesome, right? Let's go find some butterflies. And it smells really good. It does smell good in here with all the flowers and everything. It's really pretty. All right guys, so we made it all the way to Mexico to where we are now gonna go on the Grand Fiesta Tour starring yeah. the... the... Three Caballeros. Good job, because I cannot say <laughs> that. <laughs> and I figured this would be a good attraction that Logan would actually enjoy. Especially it's super hot out and everything. You want a nice, cool, relaxing ride? This is the one. And the wait time is basically zero. Yeah. This is the wait time I actually like right here. Basically a walk on. I will say for Logan's first time riding some of these rides, he's done really good. <laughs> Just keep his hands semi far away. <laughs> Look at him. I won't want no. They're pretty cool. So as you guys can see, there are some awesome looking character topiaries throughout the park with this Flower and Garden Festival. And a lot more stuff going on. Over 500,000 plants is what they use to make this whole event happen. And there's also some other things going on. Yeah, they also have concerts uh, on select days. I think usually it's on the weekend. Okay. But it's really cool. And also they have like kiosks with different like foods and drinks too that you can enjoy. Kind of like the food and wine festival but it's slightly different. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, I just, if we had more time today, I would like to try out some more of the different foods and everything, but we'll come back. Oh yeah. Festival's still going on for a little bit longer anyways. So, like I said, check this out. All right guys, so we are finally gonna go on Spaceship Earth five minute wait so we're gonna be good to go yeah we'll and the see. questionable part is whether or not logan <laughs> is going to be able to handle this hopefully yeah he did good with nemo he did yeah. good with the three caballeros mm -hmm. so, so hopefully this one is going to be smooth yeah we'll see what happens <laughs>
Priscilla, what happened to you? I don't know, I look different. <laughs> yeah. Just just a little bit. And poor Logan's not even there either. <laughs> just my creepy face. Yeah. It's not a not a good picture at all. Oh my god, that's terrible. Not a good picture. <laughs> Alright, Logan. You did so good! Knocked out three rides today at Epcot. Great job. <laughs> all right, guys. Thank you all for joining us today. Had a good time. So, yeah, Logan knocked out three rides. That's pretty good for him. Yeah. One so. more thing I would like to say is that a lot of people think that Epcot is not for kids because it's not like Magic Kingdom at all, but there's a lot of things that, that are fun for kids too. Logan had a great time, so. Yeah, I think it's a good park for kids too. Yeah, and definitely. it's beautiful and very relaxing. Yeah, yeah, and like I was saying earlier too, besides just rides, this is a cool shot with like the uh, ball yeah. back there, right? <laughs> so yeah, like how majority of theme parks you visit, it's all about ride, 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 ride. Where Epcot is so cool because there's so many different options. Mm -hmm. So, especially when you come during some of the special events like yeah. Flower and Garden and everything and like that food and wine visit all the different countries there's always something cool like treats and you know things that yeah, you yeah. won't find anywhere else so. exactly it's not all just go 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 all the time yeah yeah so thank you all for watching had a great time make sure if you haven't yet go ahead and subscribe to our channel because we are going to be coming out with disney vlogs at least one a week so it's going to be super exciting we're going to have a lot of fun i think next week we're going to animal kingdom is the plan so Anyways, thank you. Make sure to like the video, smash the notifications bell, and I'll see you on the next video. See you on the next video. Bye. Peace.